Yeah, I just filmed boiling water. <laughs> So it looks like it's gonna be mostly cloudy today. And then we got rain for the next three days out here in Quartzsite. So today I'm gonna go do a little bit of exploring um, before the rain gets here. And uh, there's a couple spots I wanna go check out. I'm gonna finish my tea, I'm gonna pack up, uh, and then we'll take off. me thinking because a labyrinth is usually just a straight line or a straight path through a bunch of things and as long as you stay on the path you you eventually get to the end right and then you know you have a start you have a finish you, you follow one path right and then a maze a maze is similar because you have a start you have a finish but in a maze, you run into a bunch of dead ends and then you eventually find your way out. But a spiral labyrinth, like, it doesn't make sense to me because you start, you go to the center, you hit a dead end, and then you have to go back to the very beginning. So there really is no end. So really a spiral labyrinth, I mean, people can debate me on this, but a spiral labyrinth is really just a maze with a single dead end. <laughs> That's what I uh, thought of as I was eating my sandwich, just kind of out here. But uh, anyways, I figured I'd make a little contribution on this, on this little little rock that I liked. So I'm gonna put it here with all this other cool stuff. I uh, made it to my next camp after the uh, the spiral labyrinth. I went further on down the road and down there is a kind of a trail that goes up into um, a canyon. Um, it's called Palm Canyon. If you walk way further down into it, um, it eventually gets to this really cool spot where um, there's palm trees kind of growing in the canyon, like really far deep down there. Um, but me and Rex didn't quite make it all the way that far, but I'll just roll the footage of a little bit of the hike and stuff that way. Um, and then I'm also gonna close this video out uh, because I'm tired. <laughs> so yeah, uh, I'll see you guys next time. See ya.